Welcome to the History AI Podcast, where the past comes alive with facts, anecdotes, and a dash of humor. Here are your hosts, Chuck and Marco. Welcome to another episode of the History AI Podcast. I'm Chuck, and as always, I'm joined by my co-host Marco. Today we'll be unraveling the story of a legend, Erastus Deef Smith, a figure whose name rings through the annals of Texas history. And though his name suggests otherwise, he was anything but silent in carving his legacy. That's right Chuck, Deef Smith's story is a sonic boom in the timeline of the Texas Revolution. Born in New York in 1787, Deef moved to Texas in 1821, well before it was the Lone Star State. Deef was known for his outstanding reconnaissance skills and a pivotal role during the Texas Revolution. Today, we'll be diving into the life and times of this American frontiersman and spy. Before we embark on the tempest of Deef's adventures, let's talk about his early life. Born to Chillab and Mary Smith, Deef was the youngest of twelve siblings. His youth was marked by a bout of childhood illness which led to his hearing impairment. But as we'll see, his so-called disability became a unique strength in the turbulent times that lay ahead. Indeed Chuck. Deef's family was of humble means, and young Erastus sought to change his fortune by venturing into the unknown territories of the South. Before the Texas Revolution, Deef married Guadalupe Ruiz Duran, a union that bore four daughters. Now let's dive into his time before the Texas Revolution. Though called Deef Smith, his eyesight was eagle-sharp and his wilderness skills were unparalleled. He became acquainted with the land like the back of his hand, his knowledge proving invaluable in the years to come. He certainly was a maverick of survival and reconnaissance. Now, fast-forwarding to his time with the Rangers, Deef Smith was part of the Texian army, enlisting as a scout. His abilities to track and gather intelligence were a nightmare for anyone against the Texian cause. And the storm of the Texas Revolution was where Deef's talents truly shined. His scouting led to the capture of Mexican General Cos, which was a turning point in the struggle. Deef's deeds didn't stop there, he was the eyes and ears of the Texian forces, rendering services that were nothing short of heroic. Absolutely. His most notable exploit during the revolution was at the Battle of San Jacinto, where his intel was crucial for the Texian victory. His reconnaissance was a masterclass of strategic foresight that tipped the scales in favor of Texas. We'll be right back after this short break. Wave goodbye to sugar-loaded boosts and say hello to Strike Force Energy. The energy drink additive revolutionizing how you power up, all without a single calorie or sugar. Just a squeeze, and you're set for action. Ready to make the switch? Visit StrikeForceEnergy.com. And for our listeners, spark your savings with an exclusive 20% discount. Just use code UTSALAX24 at checkout. Remember, UTSALAX24. Strike Force Energy, elevate every sip. Welcome back to the History AI Podcast. After the Texas Revolution, Deef Smith didn't hang his boots. He continued to serve Texas, creating the Deef Smith Spy Company, ensuring the safety and sovereignty of the fledgling republic. He was indeed a guardian at the gates. However, his life post-revolution was short-lived. Deef passed away in 1837 at the age of 50. Even in death, his legacy lived on, with counties and towns named in his honor. His name became synonymous with bravery and exceptional service. And speaking of legacy, Deef Smith's story is a testament to the indomitable spirit of adventure and service. His contributions are etched in the identity of Texas, making him a timeless figure in its history. And let's not forget the small quirks and humor surrounding Deef's narrative. Like the time when someone yelled a warning about an approaching danger, Deef didn't hear it but was the first to spot the danger miles off, showcasing that his other senses were in overdrive. That's right Chuck. His life was filled with ironies and triumphs, making Deef Smith a name worth remembering and celebrating. Well, that wraps up another thrilling episode of the History AI Podcast. We hope you enjoyed diving into the life and times of Deef Smith as much as we did. Remember to like, rate, and share our podcast with your friends and family. We'll be back with another episode, unraveling the threads of history, making the past come alive. Until then, I'm Chuck. And I'm Marco. Thanks for tuning in.